What is good Marble Squad and welcome back to our channel. Mariah currently cannot talk. She has a thing called the, what's it called? Leningitis, and it's where your vocal cords get affected from being sick and she literally can't talk. Like, actually try to talk right now. Hi. Out of all days, today is the day that she's had this, but she's had this for the past week. It's not gonna stop us. As you see by today's title, that is not a joke. This is not a prank. We are going to the airport within the next 10 minutes to pick up our main coon kitten, our second main coon. And he is going to be landing in probably a half hour, an hour. Y'all, this has been in the works for the past month, month and a half. We have been hiding it from you and it's crazy because because today is the day that we are picking him up. I had a lot of convincing I had to do in order to get him to say yes to me, which Bill did fill my reaction. Okay, okay, rest your voice, rest your voice. If you see that I'm excited right now, I was not excited at first. I did not want a fourth cat. I still don't care to have four cats, okay? But I'm gonna love this guy, and I know he's gonna be an awesome addition to the family. I just, I'm set with cats, okay? This is gonna be our last cat, our last cat. You gotta promise. Pinky problems. I do want this cat. Don't think Mariah's forcing me to get this cat. But I definitely was not on the cat mindset and I did not care to get a fourth. But now after seeing him and after talking about him for the past month, our baby is gonna be here and he's gonna be awesome and it's gonna be fun and it's gonna be cool. Shout out to our breeder. I'm so sorry if I'm saying your name wrong. Zaina, she has been nothing but amazing. I am so grateful to have her and have such amazing breeder. <laughs> Okay, we're, we're so thankful. Yeah, everyone, make sure to go show our breeder love. She literally went above and beyond. You know, she's such a good person. She's such an awesome woman, and she takes care of these cats like they are literally gonna be hers forever, and, and we love that. So we are on our way to the airport, y'all. I am getting nervous. Mariah's been, like, kind of anxious for the past, like, two or three hours, but, like, I'm getting nervous. Like, we've only been talking about him for a month, a month and a half, but now that we actually get to see him, it's just insane, and I don't know y'all don't know the color and y'all don't know his name yet I think we should make you wait so we have something that they call a flight nanny that is a person all right that will literally take your pet travel across the states or the country wherever you want them to fly with your pet and they will deliver them to you at your nearest airport or an airport of your choosing that you guys arrange behind the scenes so our flight nanny flew out of cali that is where our baby boy was from he stopped in in texas for a layover and then because there's like no direct flights all the way to florida and then from texas he is on his way here i'm sure he's going to be landing what time is it 3 15 he's supposed to be landing by 3 45 so about half hour maybe so we have about a half hour to get to the airport and then we have to be ready and waiting because how this is going to work y'all is it's basically going to be like a running play in football the pet nanny is literally gonna come out of the airplane meet us at the departure doors hand us the cat take a picture make sure that we got him everything's good and then he's gonna go off and fly home like it's that fast the gentleman's been literally on a plane for like seven hours today six hours today and he's just gonna get right back on a plane and go back so it's crazy that people do that I'm thankful because Mariah's sick we wouldn't have even probably been able to go and do it and this just works out so much better because she's sick it would have been hours and hours of flying. And on top of that, they luckily were able to give our Maine Coon a little medicine to make the nerves better when he's flying. So it's it's not as, you know, nerve wracking. And you know, for a cat, a lot of plane is scary. So I'm very curious on how he's gonna be when we get him. I'm sure he's gonna be fully awake and ready to run around and use the bathroom and stuff. But are you ready to go get him? We're halfway to the airport, y'all. All we gotta do is wait 45 minutes and, we, and he's here. Oh my gosh. All right, well, we'll see you when we get to the airport and while we're waiting for him, maybe we'll flip up on the camera when we're about to go pick him up. I don't know exactly how it's gonna happen, but the moment he texts us saying, pull up, we are gone. I almost just said his name. Our cat, uh, which we have not said his name yet, is five minutes from landing. Five minutes from landing at the airport. We are here and it is, oh, my bad, oh my God. Thank you. It is downpouring. We just got Duncan and she just ran out here to go give us our stuff. Look at this. You can't even tell. It's pouring. You can you could probably hear it, but five minutes to go before they land and it's probably gonna be another 10 minutes after that in order to actually pick them up. So we are T minus 20 minutes maybe from getting them. <laughs> just got a note and I'm walking out now. So I'll find about three minutes when I'm at the front, okay? Okay, awesome. I'll start heading up okay, now. Okay. Awesome. Baby, you honestly should let me do the talking. Well, I don't know. He Shh. Let's go. All right. Oh my God, oh my God. 
Okay, Y'all, so we are pulling up. If you're wondering why the camera's angled this way, we're gonna try to capture as much as we can on that side of the car. So I feel like that's where we're gonna see him and he's probably gonna be right here. And we can, you know, film picking him up. Try to at least. Departures, here we come. That's crazy that we're literally 30 seconds away from seeing our final dream cat. It's like weird, bro. Y'all are about to see our fourth baby. Are you ready? Let's go. Hello? Hi, I just pulled up. We're in the we're in the car right behind you. We're coming out. This white one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello. Okay. All right. All right. Sorry, my voice. No, don't be sorry. It's nice to meet you. You wanna sit up here? Yeah. Hey, hey, man. What's going on? Hey, yeah, likewise. Thank you so much. Oh man, dude. Oh, man. So if you don't mind, I'm gonna take some pictures of you guys. Oh, yeah. You wanna maybe grab a seat and then yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll take a picture. How's you guys doing? Oh, it was good, yeah. How was the flight? Oh man, dude. I think I don't know. I was watching him so much, yeah. you know. But he was just like Hi baby. He was just like, dude. He's you know? so cute. <laughs> Hi. Hey, Hi hey, baby. Hey. All right, guys. Alright, well definitely see you guys. Have a safe flight back. Absolutely. I'm gonna send you a message in the group chat. Hey, thank you. Guys. Have a safe flight. Baby. Oh my gosh, he is so tiny. Y'all meet Winnie, our Maine Coon kitten. He's four months old and he is in orange, orange little baby Maine Coon. Look at him. <laughs> oh my gosh, he is so pretty. He's Look so at his fur. Sweet. He is so sweet. He is going to get along with Scar so well. Are you ready to go home and see your brothers? You got three brothers. <laughs> oh, he's so cute. Oh my gosh, look at his little face too. I know Mariah wants to scream right now out of this joy, is, but... This is my dream color right here. Oh my gosh, this is her second dream color. Her first was like a black smoke. We got Scar and he turned out to be an all black, but then Mariah fell in love with the orange, which I am in love with the orange cats too, but look at how cute he is. Look at how much of a baby he is. But he's way bigger than Scar. Scar was only like seven weeks. When we got him, six or but seven he's weeks. Still tiny. He is still, yeah, super tiny. Hi. Hey. Hi. He's so sweet. He's tiny. His ears, just compared to Scar, are just so tiny. Oh, he's so confused. Meet Winnie, y'all. His name is Winnie after Winnie the Pooh. They had like a Winnie the Pooh kind of bundle. What were the other two brothers' names? He has two other brothers. Was it Pooh? No. <laughs> Winnie Tigger and Kanga, so super cute. He's the Winnie out of them, and we're gonna call him Winnie the Pooh all the time. I already know I am. I can't believe we have four cats. Like, no, but he, I'm not, I don't even care if I use my voice right now. This is, I just see orange one person, it's crazy. It's so weird. The only other orange one we've ever seen is Mia, Madeline Stevens' cat. We've never really seen an orange one in person. No, there was a stray cat that looked just like Winnie in Jamaica. Remember that orange one that came up to the table? He's so cute. We're gonna spend a little time with Winnie on the drive home. We don't want to overload him too much, so we're just gonna keep petting him and make him feel as at home as we can. But once we get back, I'll flip on the camera. We'll have him go in our room, and I don't think we're gonna have him meet our other cats today yet, but let's get him used to the space and play with some new toys and just get him used to his new life with us and the Marble Squad. <laughs> we're on our way home, and it's only been about 15 minutes, and Winnie already fell asleep in Mariah's arms for the first time. He's literally knocked out. He's probably super stressed and winded from the whole flight, the whole day, being out of his original home, away from his mother for the first time. So we really wanna do as much as we can to not make him stressed. We're not gonna have him meet the cats today, like I said. We're honestly gonna wait a couple days before he even meets the cats. But he's so cute, look at him sleep. So we just made it home. Megan's here, by the way, and we are going to just go straight into the bedroom, not going to bother any of our kittens. I don't think they have any suspicion that there's another cat here at all, but we're going to pull him out, see what he does. Oh, let me shut this door first. Hey, Winnie. Hey, Winnie. Hi, buddy. You're tiny. You're so little. <laughs> hey. Hey. Sniffing. He's a tiny person. Oh, look at mommy got you a bunch of stuff. Oh, all this? Are there toys in here? Oh, bad. We have brand new toys and stuff. Hey, Winnie. What are you sniffing? Oh, you're going to jump down? Oh, my gosh. Look at him go. I think, look, you want some food? I think he's going to go under the bed. Look. His tail's down. He's freaking out. Winnie, look. <gasps> Winnie. Yeah, he's definitely, like, unsure because 
Think about it, he's been on a plane forever. <gasps> oh, <laughs> yeah. Hi, where are you going? What are you doing? Exploring. Hey. <laughs> so my sister and her boyfriend are over <laughs> looking at Winnie. Everyone's checking him out. He's broken in pretty good, right? He was hissing at the other cats, not him. He was not hissing. Snap was hissing under the door. But he's been breaking in just fine. He was sleeping next to Mariah. Been a couple hours here. He's having a good old time. He knows the whole bathroom now. And he's eating the litter. <laughs> yeah, and he's eating the litter. He doesn't exactly know. Oh boy. The oh, litter is not just a potty, but like food. <laughs> oh, I think the old litter they had was like grainy. Yeah, the old litter was different litter. So he thinks this new litter is like some source of food. <laughs> <laughs> but then he just like gags on it. I'm like, dude. I'm like, he's just, just let him eat it because he's just no. gonna find out it's not supposed to go down your throat. Winnie, good morning. Good morning, baby. How are you doing? How are you feeling? You're looking good. Looking healthy. Eating his food. Drinking his water. It is the next morning. Winnie has been doing amazing. The whole night he slept with us. He honestly, not that he kept us up, but Mariah and I woke up a lot last night. Yeah. And we definitely were like playing with him throughout the entire night. Like I literally at one point at like 3 a.m. came down on the floor and was petting him. And he was like, you know, rubbing up on me and stuff. And every time we would wake up, we'd bring him back in the bed or we'd wake up and he'd be right next to us or by our feet and he's super lovey he's super comfortable it looks like and honestly it doesn't even seem like he traveled across the country mm -hmm. yesterday but we hope you guys enjoyed this little mini vlog of getting him and he's so perfect look at him he's literally so cute and we are going to be doing another updated video of him meeting our other three cats so if you do want to go see that video please show us some support and give this one a thumbs up for winnie's sake tell everybody give this video a thumbs up, thumbs up. and turn on those post notifications y'all so you will be notified once we do post that video it is going to be a good one because if you've ever seen cats meet before you know it's not a good sight to see there's probably gonna be a lot of fighting a lot of hissing a lot of smacking uh, and if you do want to see them meet we're gonna section it off we already have a gate put up we haven't introduced them yet we're gonna wait until we film that video and give him a couple days to really relax in our house and enjoy himself he loves Mariah though. He does. He literally, look at how cute he is. He follows her everywhere. He's just like a little, little stinky little boy. He's been eating good and drinking good too. If y'all stayed all the way up until this point for the comment of the day, I want y'all to all comment down below his name, which is Winnie or have Winnie in part of your comment. It's W-I-N-N-I-E. Yes. Winnie. We will be choosing some of y'all to shout out in our next video. I don't know if we're behind on a shout out or not, but we are going to be shouting out in our next video. Everyone that comments down below, Winnie, we're going to keep up with it again because Mariah has been sick for the past week and everything kind of got confusing. So if y'all do want a chance to get shouted out, make sure to be commenting down below. His little name, Winnie. And also, what do you think about this precious little boy? Look at him. And he's such a loud purr too. He just loves life. You wanna go for a car ride? <laughs> Get you a little pop cup. He's so cute. But thank y'all so much for watching this video. We hope you enjoyed it and we will see you in the next one. But until then, peace. peace. Love, Love you guys. guys. Say peace, Winnie. Love you guys.